Hi there, it's Miss Pritzel at the Appleton West Library, and I'm book talking something I'm really excited about. Uh, this is Five Survived by Holly Jackson, and I'm excited because Holly Jackson is the author of A Good Girl's Guide to Murder, that trilogy, which is one of the most awesome mystery series for young adults uh, today. Uh, so this book, uh, if you are like somebody where you have to have a mystery where a crime is being solved, may not be for you, but I was very happy with this. This is more of an action thriller uh, that Holly Jackson wrote. So it is I five survived because there are six main characters uh, and they are going on spring break. They've rented an RV or borrowed somebody's RV and they're going to go on this camping trip on spring break. So our main character is Red. Uh, real name is Redford and it's a girl. <laughs> to see you where, who is uh, on the trip with her best friend Maddie and another classmate who's a boy and then another um, kid their same age who is also a boy that they've met at parties and stuff but doesn't go to their school and then also Red's brother and his girlfriend. So we've got two who are slightly older like in college and the other four are seniors. Uh, this takes place from between 10 o'clock p.m. at one night and 6 o'clock a.m. the next morning. So anytime you have a book like that, it's always very fast-paced action, filled with action type thing. Uh, so, like I said, they're on his RV, headed for spring break. Um, they get lost, shocker, because uh, they're driving at night in a place they don't know. Uh, it, I did like to include a map of the Vista uh, trailer that they're in and which is important for the movie and a little map of where they're headed um, and they get lost and they go down this gravel road and they're like oh you need to back up so when they start to back up um, one of the tires blows so they get out they replace the tire and then they try to back out again another tire blows and they're like hmm you know that's when I started to go wait <laughs> something's wrong here uh, but of course they don't think of it well it turns out there's a sniper out there waiting for them and has kind of lured them to this location um, and the sniper has this very well plotted out and the sniper one of the kids has a secret and the sniper wants to know that secret and most people feel it's related to, um, so Red's best friend is Maddie. Um, Maddie's mother is an assistant pro district attorney, so she is a pr she prosecutes criminals. And she's in the middle of a really big case where there's an important witness. So um, they believe that, most of the kids believe that the sniper wants to know who um, who is this witness because it's been held, it's been kept very secret. Uh, but a lot of other things come out. So these are a pretty smart group of kids and they try to figure out ways to get out of the thing without the sniper, but it turns out there might be more than one sniper. Uh, and like I said, the sniper, um, at one point it leaves them a radio and I can't remember how that happens exactly. Cause I read it in November, but then I had to order it and wait for it to come and get barcode and everything. So you guys could check it out. Uh, I just, like I said, if you want a strict mystery like the Good Girl's Guide to Murders are, uh, this may not be for you, but if you like mystery, like I, there's a mystery of like, who, who is this person? What do they want? Um, you know, there's six people in the RV and it says five survive. And yes, um, the sniper does actually shoot some people. Uh, so, <laughs> um, like I said, the sniper has this very well planned out and thought out and you start to question everybody. And I have to say like, uh, in a situation like this where you're all stuck in the same area and it's like life or death situation, you know, everybody's true character kind of shows out. And uh, let's just say Red's brother, Oliver is, yeah, I don't like Oliver, but you know, there's always gotta be a character you don't, in a situation like this, there's always gonna be a character you hate. So um, I hope you will come in and check out uh, I know somebody already checked out another, about two copies. Somebody already checked out the other copy of this. Um, so I hope you come and check this one out. Check out another mystery or thriller or something else because I love to help people find books that they want to read. So whatever your genre is, I'll help you find it because uh, that's my job. Hope you have a great day and keep on reading.